Bingo. The world's favorite soda. And after the devastating soda wars of 2159, the world's only soda. Considering the fact that I'm inside a police station, it might be prudent to pay for the soda first. Let's see. Cola, lemon, lime, lemon lime, strawberry, strawberry lime, strawberry cola, cherry cola. Yuck! I'll go with the old standby. Bingo classic. Boring, but safe. Archives. It's a retinal scanner, instantly outdated by the genetic scanner, but I guess here they don't care. I don't think so. The security feedback will probably fry my eyeballs. The showers. Unisex, of course. Sergeant Anthony McDonald. Sergeant Morty Lowe. Sergeant Maria Hernandez. Sergeant Ricky Mah Sergeant Russell Franco. Sergeant Frank Manelli. It's a light switch. It's occupied. Hi! Who's in there? Manelli. Who's asking? God, I know that voice. What? Who are you? Agent Scully, FBI. You'll be wanting the chief's office then. That's down the hall. Oh my God, pain. Hello? <laughs> Who is it? <laughs> it's me. Oh, hey, hey, wait. I know that voice. Identify yourself. Uh, um, I gotta run. Hey, hold it, come back. Oh my god, that hurts. Hello? Who is it? Pizza delivery. Oh god, don't mention pizza. Christ. Hello? Who is it? Sergeant Hernandez! Maria! Thank God you're here. Listen, I need you to get my stomach medicine from the locker. Here's the key. Oh, God! It's the key to Frank Minnelli's locker. It's a receptacle for a synthetic eye. I guess Frankie Boy's using one of those babies. Can never tell from looking at him. Tummy ooh ah. Fast relief for a runny tummy. Sergeant Manelli's been banging this locker shut one too many times. Say hello to seven years of bad luck, guy. That sure makes me feel a whole lot better about harassing him. It's a loose shard of the mirror glass. I'll just carefully separate this shard from the mirror. Like so. I'll have to be careful carrying this around. Archives, login. F. Minnelli. Password, wife's birthday. What a smart boy. Real security, Liz. Oh, thank God, thank God. Uh. How are you?
are you feeling? Better. A little better. I need it. I think this medicine is flushing out my system a little, you know what I mean? It's accelerating the natural process. The soup! The soup! The soup! No need to go any further, sir. Thanks, Maria. Hey, you got a cold or something? You sound different. Yeah, a cold or... I got something, all right. How's Mrs. Minnelli doing? Why are you asking? I didn't think it... Oh, hell, Maria, we spoke about this. I told you I... Can't you just let it rest? Uh, sure, sorry. Just... wondering. I wish you wouldn't, Maria. You know how... It is what it is, you know? About Mrs. Minnelli. God damn it, Maria, I'm on the freaking can, yeah? I was just thinking, maybe I should get her a birthday present. What do you think? Are you nuts? Have you gone completely nuts? What are you doing? What the hell are you doing? Being nice? Nice! You want Laura to kick me out of my own apartment, is that it? You want my wife to kick me out of the apartment tomorrow? Tomorrow? Your wife's birthday's tomorrow? You're not buying her a present, Maria. Don't even think about it. That would be such a big mistake. You don't want to make a mistake like that. Okay, boss. You're the boss. Don't call me boss. And would you leave me alone? I'm not in a sociable mood. Hell, I'm on the can! Gotta go, Manelli. Thanks for your help, Maria. Jesus, I think I'm allergic to the goddamn medicine. Oh, crap, my the eye! In there. What the hell happened to my... Maria! Maria, did you take my eye? Give it back! There you are. Back in your slot. Monkey see, monkey do. Well, not without Dude. this he won't. Oh crap, my eye! There you are. Back in your slot. Oh god, I'm seeing red. I'm having a stroke. Maria! Maria, go get the doctor fast! I'm seeing red! It's Frank Minnelli's synthetic eye. I'm just... um... borrowing it. He'll get it back. If I remember my digital history lessons correctly, that's what's called a dot matrix printer. They used that in, like, the 18th century or something. It's a computer from, like, the Stone Age. I've never seen anything like it outside of a museum. It's a miracle it's still working, let alone in active service. It's a control panel with a weird keyboard. Hi, I'm Frank Minnelli, and I feel really guilty doing this. I, uh, love my wife Laura, and her birthday is on the 31st of this month, which means... Laura 0731? Please, 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 please. Yes, I am so good. Again. Now, what to search for? It 
It's a long shot, but... The Church of Voltec is the front of the Vanguard use here in Stark, so there must be at least some information available. Jacob McAllen. White Cardinal? What the hell is that? I should keep that name in mind, though. It could turn out to be important. The so-called White Cardinal. I wonder who he is. I'm just going to make sure there's no warrant or anything out for my arrest. Warren's sister, and that's her colonization number. I'd better remember it, in case I need it. I don't think I need to see any more of Warren's rap sheet. He's been... kinda active. Whoa! I think I just killed Warren! Oh well, he's just gonna have to, uh, live with that. At least the cops and corporates won't be after him anymore. Just the morgue. sister. Please, please let there be something. It's the only lead I have, so if this falls through, I'm out of luck. I'd better get a hard copy of this for Warren. I hope nobody's watching. It's a control panel for the archive retrieval unit. There's nothing in here. Oh, except for a tiny data cube. I'll leave it until I've printed out all the information I need. are rolling. 
Now, where's the printer? It's a screwdriver. <laughs> the repairman must have left it by accident. <coughs> There's no way I'm going back down into the basement. I'd rather be rolled out of here on a gurney with my body wrapped in black plastic. <coughs> I'm not completely mistaken, and if I remember my tech classes correctly, that's an anti-gravity control unit. It looks fully intact. Move along. There is nothing to see here. Except for that crashed hovercraft. Nah. You see those everywhere these days. Sorry? Dime a dozen. Crashed hovercraft are a dime a dozen? Fifteen a week, ma'am. At the very least. In this city alone. But they say it's the safest mode of transportation available. Statistically, yes. Unless you're aboard one of the buggers. Then your chance of survival drops drastically. What? They're the safest mode of transportation if you stay on the ground. The chances of being hit by one going down are relatively low. Thanks for ruining my trust in modern technology. We're here to protect and serve. Isn't it the other way around? Just keep it moving, ma'am. Nothing to see here. Except for you, officer. Hey, me? I always did love a man in a uniform. Sorry, ma'am, but I'm gay. Now, move along. Nothing to see here. <laughs> Except for the escaped convict right behind you. I'm on special duty today, ma'am. So that escaped convict will have to take care of himself. After all, who guard this perimeter in my absence? Uh, me? I'll be good. That was a rhetorical question, ma'am. You are not qualified. Now, move along. Nothing to see here. Except... I won't tell you again, so move along. There is absolutely nothing to see here. Nothing. Jeez, don't you people have anything better to do? <coughs> Are you feeling all right, officer? Thank you, ma'am. I'm fine. All the dust from the debris is just choking me up. How did it go? Did you get the information? Is my sister okay? It wasn't easy, but I did it. Your sister's fine. You don't have to worry about the law or the corporates anymore.
That's great. That's... Thank you. Really. Thank you. So do you have the information for me? Sure, right here. Listen, Warren. Your parents... They're... They're dead. But your sister's okay. She's been adopted by some woman named Drake, a lieutenant with the Wakamba Mercer Corporation. My sister's a corp brood? And my... My parents... You know that should hurt, but it doesn't. I don't feel anything. My parents left me a long time ago. But my sister... I gotta find her. I'm sure you will, Warren. Hey, wait a minute. You killed me? Thanks a lot. Well, when you're dead, nobody cares. The cops are not gonna be chasing after you for crimes committed by a dead guy. Yeah, you're right. But I'm gonna have a tough time getting a new ID. You should've just wiped my record clean. I'm not complaining, though. I'm better off now than I was a few hours ago. So what can I do for you now, sister? Can you put me in touch with your friend now? Yeah, for the information you needed? Right, you got it. Head on out to the Newport docks, down in the outskirts of the city. It's all deserted now since they stopped using the boats for cargo shipments. Head across the construction yard to a large garage. You can't miss it. It's got all these large tubes outside. Knock three times on the door and tell Burns Flipper, and this guy's weird, so don't mind the stuff he says. Tell the Flipper that I sent you. I'll call ahead to let him know you're coming. He should be able to help you out with almost everything you need to know, okay? Thanks. Bye, Warren. Hey, keep it cool, sister. Thank you. 